Hey, hello again for the second part. This is a standard counter. For that standard counter, it has two sensors, one located on the right, the other one on the left. So the one on the right is going to count up, the other one on the left is going to count down. But these two are counting up and down without sensing the direction of counting. So now, you get put on. This one is provided with a microcontroller. So as you can see, it's making a test first, and then it goes to zero. So in the moment anybody comes closer to this one here, like putting the hand in front of it, it's going to start counting, one, two, three, and so on. And on the other side, if we do it, it's going to count back, and when it's zero, there is an LED saying it's a zero, okay? But as a standard counter, it doesn't do a big deal other than counting. Now we focus on a similar prototype to the one we've seen upstairs in the bathroom. You can put it on now. Good. So this one, if we put it on, no, it can pass, okay? So anybody passing by is going to be counted. Yeah, another people coming. So the light remains green, but this one is made to count up to four. So when the fourth one was coming, the red light starts to blink. It's a warning. Hey, wait until somebody is going to come out. However, it does not prevent it from counting further on. Because if people are continuing to count, to come, so the counter is just going up, okay? Yeah, it's going up, okay? But now in order to make it counting down, we have to figure out the opposite direction. So the, the red light is keeping blinking until eventually it's going to be coming below the number four. So it's going to three. And as long as the counting is below three, the light remains green. Everything is based on these two sensors here, which are underneath. These ones are calibrated up to 0 0.8 meters. So this is why when I'm trying to pass like this, it's still counting because the sensor is seeing me back or forth, it doesn't matter. So obviously, when people are passing in the opposite direction and the counter reaches back zero, it should stop at zero, obviously. So even if we simulate somebody Passing again is not counting below zero, okay? Because out of the room, you can't have negative 99, okay? Thank you very much for this presentation, guys.